Good day guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. In my last video, I talked about how to create a pivot chart with a pivot table data in order to have a more structuralized chart data within the pivot table data. So today, we are moving into another feature of Microsoft Excel pivot table called FitTime pivot table data. In my previous video tutorial, we have been able to summarize this pivot table from over 10,000 plus record. Now that we got this summarized data on my screen, all right, by filtering data, I can decide not to see all this data on this pivot table. However, I just want to see specific records in summarized pivot table data all right with the microsoft excel pivot table we have few different ways to filter the result of a pivot table all right i'm going to show you two of the options right here in this tutorial and in my next video video lecture I'm going to show you a relatively relatively new tools that was introduced in Microsoft Excel 2010 edition. Now, take a look. This is how you can filter a pivot table. All right? You can see here if I click on anywhere on my pivot table, you can see that I have row labels and column labels row labels being for different products here why the column labels being for different countries we have afghanistan Albania, nigeria and angola and so on now right to the top here i got my drop down drop down menu if i give it a click you can see i have whole product listed listed that makes up the pivot table in other words i can check and uncheck from this drop down menu to my desire to structure the pivot table all right it is as simple as that okay let me select click on select all here then maybe okay let me choose any items here mm, let me see let me choose beverages all right and let me see what, what i can choose again okay let me choose beverages and fruit now let me click on okay you can you can see that I got the details I got. This is just a simple little way of filtering from a summarized pivot table data. All right. Okay. However, if you if you look at my chart, also here, it is also updated automatically because you can see that you can see that I got only beverages and food showing at the bottom of the chart that is also goes what to the what to the column level as well here i can decide to want to filter for only angola here i can decide to filter for only angola and what algeria let me see angola okay angola and algeria you can see that automatic automatically my pivot table changes why also simultaneously my word my pivot chart also changing as well telling you that the pivot table and the pivot chart are connected this is now this is just a one method of what running a feature within the pivot table data just like the way we we did in our previous video however 
There is another option of filtering pivot table. Remember that pivot table is also connected to one to the pivot table feed here. In other words, pivot table is connected to one filters section under the word drag and feed section. Let's say let me let's say I drag the region here into the one filter section. We can see and now my power table has, has additional elements where I can now filter by what by region. All right. Now let's say I want to see only Middle East on this data to display on this table here. All I need to do is just to go to to my new additional filter element here and select middle east all right and click on okay you can see that it has been able to give me the data represented by only middle east and as well my chart also updated it said all right if i want to select multiple items from the wall from the list what i need to do is what to check the box here all i need to do is just to check the box here you can see just check the box here and select it so i can be able to select whichever details i actually want to want it to display on my word on my screen you can this this is just really simple to do you can either you can either filter the result using a drop down result using a drop down filter main element within the pivot table or you filter your result from the word pivot table field section whatever operations you want you want to give the you want to give the result definitive wins it will be the same just try it out build yourself a quick pivot table done from our previous class apply your filter search for those specific record from drug down menu and you are there try it out